Last summer, a severe case of arthritis in his knee made it impossible for Ed Schultz to put on his shoes. A scan of his knee confirmed the problem. There was no cartilage at all, no cushioning of any kind between the bones. And so when I'd walk, it was, it was a mortar and pestle grinding away at uh, each other. Until recently, fixing the problem would have meant total knee replacement. Because only part of Ed's knee was affected, Dr. Michael Bronson recommended a far less invasive option, a partial knee replacement. In a unicompartmental replacement, what we're doing is just resurfacing those, that area which is worn out. A metal runner and small plastic disc replace the worn cartilage, providing a new cushion between the bones. The 45-minute procedure requires a much smaller incision than a total knee replacement, has less blood loss, and a faster recovery. Whereas in a total knee replacement, we talk about recovery being three to six months. In these operations, we're talking about weeks. Even more encouraging is that the improvement lasts. And the data that is just coming back after 10 years shows that 95% of the patients are still functioning as they did in the beginning, okay, which is an, an, an excellent long-term uh, prognosis. Uh, I really have, um, I believe, uh, virtually full mobility with a knee. If he's like the others, it will continue. This is Jennifer Matthews reporting.